What's up, Libra? It is your girl, EG. Welcome back to my channel, y'all. So if you are new, what's up? How you doing? Thank you for rocking with me. All right, for those that have been rocking with me, though, you already know what's up. I love you guys. All right, thank you so much for your support. So Libra, this is your future lover. All right, who are they? Okay, um, this information is to kind of help you make a mature decision on whether or not you want this person in your life. All right, nobody is perfect. So this just kind of gives you a little bit of insight on who they are. Okay. By the end of the video, go ahead and choose number one, two, or three, and that'll kind of give you a time frame on, you know, when this person is coming towards you in your life, okay? Um, I did get the message that for some of you guys, your person is a barber or they do hair, okay? <clears throat> for sure. All right, so let's find out, though. And I also feel like somebody has a deep voice, okay? Okay. All right, Libra, who is your future lover? East Coast. East Coast, okay. Um, bad money habits. All right, so they might not be the best at managing their money. Um, doesn't mean that they're broke. It could be, though, if we see that come out in the cards, but they're not the best at managing their money. They might blow their money, um, do the most with their money, right? They might get money and blow it, but they're just not the best with their money here, okay? Makes love a priority, though. All right, I feel like they might like to kind of go above and beyond um, and sometimes might do things to kind of keep up with the Joneses here because we have petty liar here. OK, so this person, you know, they might lie about little things, especially when it comes to the money here. All right. OK, what else? Petty liar is nothing major, but it's still kind of lying. Seriously. <laughs> All right. I think that this person really wants to be the best version of themselves for you. And that's kind of what makes them feel like they have to lie or front to you get what I'm saying to really kind of be the person that you want them to be is how I'm feeling. Um, they're always in their head. So, you know, they run their the lover off with maybe always asking questions or always assuming or just always doing the most here yeah they over promise and under deliver here okay so this person probably has a lot going on here whether it's you know they work a lot or they're something about their money here right maybe they're kind of coming up short when it comes to just their responsibilities here all right they want a family though very family oriented this person okay <coughs> They have some insecurities about them within themselves here, okay? And that's gonna, for some of you guys, here's the thing, right? Your person has some insecurities, okay, about them. And that is going to play a factor in the sense where maybe they're intimidated by you. And for some of y'all, your person might step out, right? Nothing to do with you. Maybe how you make them feel because of how boss-like you are, but it's their insecurities here. So make sure that you guys address that. What else here? Oh, a gangster. Okay. All right. It's all a gangster, right? That's going to be two, one of two things, right? It's either going to be that, you know, they're in the streets, right? In and out, you know? Maybe in and out of jail or just in and out, right? Always on the go, always. And I also feel like this person is a little bit overprotective, right? Because if they're a gangster, like they have this you know, this fear of the world and how the world, you know what I'm saying? I was like, I got to protect my family. I got to protect my domain by any means necessary, that type of vibe here. Um, I also kind of feel like, you know, th this person is just very like, maybe like hot and cold here a little bit. Okay. I, I would say this. I feel like your person, they love right? They're affectionate. Um, I think that there are certain things that they will keep from you for protection is the vibe that they're giving me. Okay. What, whatever that, that, whatever that means, maybe it's so that you don't stress or worry. Maybe it's so that the kids don't have to, maybe it's so that nobody has to see this side, right? Of this lifestyle, right? Or there's something that they hide from you, but it's giving me vibes for your protection. Okay. 
Sometimes they don't take accountability though. Okay, what else is this? Thing? Family oriented though. This person doesn't play about their family. Okay, yeah. Um, they're loving me, right? Not to you, not to everybody, but if they don't like you, then they are. Okay, so they're not letting anybody get inside their circle unless they're legit, solid, or real. Okay, um, doesn't give everyone time or energy. Okay, especially when it comes to the family. It's like, I love my family. I want to keep my family close here. Wants to take care of their lover. Okay, so this person, they have like, I don't want to say a heavy heart, but they might have a little bit heavy heart, but they just have a heavy load in the sense of, man, I got to make sure my family is good. Okay. How do they love, please? A family is very important to them, all right? Very important to them. Uh, I'll do the shopping for you, all right? So, you know, something about the money, guys. Something about the money. Very intimate this person is here. Because they said, I'll do the shopping for you. <laughs> they might be hiding some of the money the money um goals or the finances here okay oh i'll buy you gifts and jewelry i like that um i'll invest in you so you know invest is maybe it's mentally emotionally spiritually financially right They'll invest in you, though. They want to see you win, okay? I'll give you the truth and also t tough love here, okay? All right. I like it. Let's get a little bit more then. Leave me. See, they, they give you the truth, but there's something that they hide from you, okay? To protect you. Oof. Look at him staring. This person right here is a masculine, heavy East Coast energy, okay? So this person, he's gonna protect his family. He's a little bit complicated, right? Even if it's a feminine, right? It's a feminine, she's heavily in her masculine energy, all right? It's, it's kind of like this person, whoever is coming for, whoever is coming close, it's like, y'all gotta go through the fire. And then you got to get to me before you get to whatever is behind me, my family, my business, my goals, my dreams. No. All right. All right. They are a little bit complicated as a person, though. They are. All right. Very loyal, though. Okay. That's that kind of like hot and cold energy. All right. Very attractive. All right. Okay. Lord. Energy. Energy is addictive. Okay, all right, you have energy and then also um, toxic and crazy here. So they got it in them. That's what I'm gonna say. They, they have it in them, all right? It's kind of like, don't bring no problems. You won't have no problems here. But their energy is kind of like high on life here, a little bit here, okay? They like to laugh. They like to crack good jokes here. Um, they are crazy over there, so that's just heavy on here, okay? organic all right they might like to eat healthy or smoke weed sm or just smoke <laughs> that came out too fast all right. oh god best you ever had how else is this person please baby? what is this libra So I will say this um, for some of you guys, th this person, this person's cheated. They have cheating tendencies, okay? Um, because here's the thing, right? A lot of people want this person, their energy, they look good, right? A lot of people kind of want them, okay? And so, you know, you got to be careful about that here, okay? Yeah, barber, barber energy, heavy, okay? Um, you have sneaky and also illusion with I want you, okay? So whether this is somebody is like, okay, here's the thing. 
right? Because we have in and out There's two stories with this, right? So whether it's like, you know what, they might kind of mess around, but it's only for temptation. It's, it's only for pleasure. Like, it will, it will never be anything long-term, right? Or it's the fact that they have so many people coming after them, right? And it's like, you know, but I would never, right? Trust me. Trust me. Okay? All right? So it, it's like one of those two one of those two but it's one of those two okay Ooh, that one left real fast one more about this person please babe. and it's kind of like they don't like to tell you that for the fear of maybe kind of where it would put you guys in your um like yeah for the changes that it would make to the family that's what it is okay plain stuff Okay, y'all. All right, one, two, or three. All right, what's up with this person? When are you meeting them? Okay. Ooh, wee. One, two, or three. One, when are you meeting this person? Too many cards. Spirit. What are they meeting? Oh, one. Okay. I'm not saying I'm Mr. Right. Leo season next year. Okay. One year. Leo season next year. Heavy alpha energy. Okay. This person, y'all, this some of y'all, this person is a barber or does hair or something like that. Alright. Um, pile two. Um I, I, I wonder if guys, so here's the thing. For some of you guys, I wonder if this maybe kind of starts off a little bit as a fling, right? I mean, I'm just reading the story. It starts off a little bit as a fling and somebody's kind of separating from their family um, to kind of be with you here, all right? Or if you guys legit just have your own separate relationship while they have something else here, okay? Because family is very strong to this individual all right so you'll have to figure out when you meet this person if you're the person that they're having a family with or if they have a family and you're just the person that i can't tell about okay because it's here all right how to when you meet your person yeah Oh yeah, I'll wash and braid your hair, y'all. This person does hair. Something like hair. All right. How to? Oh, hold on a second. That's too many. Oh, that's all. Two how to. One more spirit. How to? <laughs> Four years. Four years, why? Do y'all wanna know why? Let's tap in. Why four years, sir? Why are they leading to my four years? All right. I, I feel like you might be the person that you kind of have to end something with here. Okay. Um, you know, you might be stuck in a situation or stuck in some energy here, okay? Because you have the death card with the two of swords, okay? So something either needs to end and it's kind of in limbo or there's this energy of somebody's maybe kind of stuck, like after some, e and either stuck on the past and don't know how to move forward or just like in this place right now of life of like changing and not necessarily seeing love right now here, right? I'm trying to get peace of mind. I'm trying to trust myself again here, you know? things like that here okay so that's just kind of where you're at for pile two okay all right pile three when don't you give up all right pile three what are you meeting a person you might meet your person through a girlfriend or a friend okay or at a gas station <laughs> Three. 
so dramatic. I know. I'm sorry. 90 days, Virgo season. All right. So this is telling me Virgo season is the next season within the next three months, but I will say it will for sure be in Virgo season. It won't be any sooner. So right now we're Leo season. It won't be now. All right. Um, earliest will be Virgo season. Okay. Uh, but within three months. Very soon. Not Leo season though. That's off the board. Okay, guys. All right. I love y'all. All right. Thank you so much for rocking with me, guys. All right. If you made it this far, please hit the like button, hit the sub button, come rock with your girl. Um, I used all my own decks for this reading. So if you see a deck that you kind of like, you know, hop over to my Etsy shop. And if you need a personal reading, all that information is below.